good evening my friends or good morning or good day <coughs> my name is Paul Callaghan as usually on Thursdays we do praying for peace it's it's a great tradition we have already for a while so uh, I'm a teacher of the Shivananda in the Shivananda tradition so uh, I'm really glad to see you, yeah, to feel you. I'm sending my love, my heart, my support to you. So, uh, and uh, right now it's 9 o'clock, we're doing it 9 o'clock by New York. I'm here in my little ashram in Brooklyn right now. So uh, I really appreciate who did pray with me uh, and with my students, with my teachers here on my platforms uh, last time and before and before. So as you know, to, when we pray together, uh, the, the energy was sending becoming much more stronger it's our best so and, uh, and as you know praying it's very strong too yeah I'm repeating the same time the same thing all the time but uh, I really mm, I really really believe in it I know it as a person, as a yoga teacher. So, uh, thank you very much for uh, for people who doing likes in here and doing like uh, some comments uh, with my posts, with sutras I put in here and uh, different kind of videos done the most important thing it's uh, to grow spiritual as you know if we grow spiritually if we have some knowledge for meditation we feel like everything is one we we're not separating we don't feel separation uh, and it's very hard to do something bad for somebody so uh, But if you have feeling of separation, I'm here, somebody over there, uh, subjective thing, it's not objective thing. When you're enlightened or in a deep like, meditation state of mind, you can feel it. Many yogis, many practitioners feel it. And it's very hard, yeah, to, to hurt somebody if you feel it. But if not, it's very easy to criticize. It's very easy to do something bad for somebody. And, uh, and it's much harder to work on yourself, to grow, to open your eyes open your heart for love for God so uh, please wake up I'm not telling you I'm just asking you spiritually read spiritual books find a teacher if it's possible and study, meditate, yoga is a good uh, path toward God, towards God, yeah, so I don't think somebody is going to do something for you, let's say peace, we are responsible for it, you and me, 
We don't think about politicians and others. Think about what you can do for peace. Pray maybe something else according to your abilities, according to your talents. So, of course, I'm asking all the time to pray for Ukraine. It's really a difficult situation, the big war coming, a lot of people suffering and dying. And please pray with me for them. Let's send some love, energy, compassion. And if you can do something, not only with the praying, help some with something, with the donation or uh, something else, will be great. So we just pray. I'm doing it silent and silent in my, inside myself. You can do it either, whatever, either way you want. And this platform doesn't matter who you are. Yoga is very flexible. Doesn't matter you. What kind of tradition you're in, nationality, age. Yeah. So use your your own brain. You can use your own words if you don't know how to pray. Just send with concentration but with no tension. Your motivation, your energy for peace. And let it go. Let it. And it's gonna help somebody for sure. It's all about energy. Our thoughts, our words, it's all helping. So let's just pray. If you're Christian, you can do Christian prayers. If you're Buddhist, Buddhist, either way, with your own words, loud or inside. The honesty and concentration is important. Thanks for your praying, for your attention. I'll see you next Thursday. Please come. Yeah, many things depends on us. Yeah, and God bless you. 
take care of yourself, help each other. Namaste.